our former players are linked to the history of the game uh, and they've inspired countless people before and after to, to get involved with the game themselves. So the um, alumni programme is, is basically a connection piece for all former players, male, female, um, to showcase a group of people that, that have gone before. Um, you know, what is it they say? We stand on the shoulders of previous um, people and, and where we are now, what we've got now is Canterbury Cricket is built on the history and I think it's really important for us to celebrate that and allow former players the opportunity to come back, reminisce, maybe not seeing each other for years and years and, and, and be part of a club that they were part of when they were playing. You know, there's, there's very few people that have had the opportunity to play for Canterbury um, and we should celebrate that. We should give them the opportunity to, to enjoy being part of that experience and that club after playing as well. Former players, once they've finished playing here, because they've reached the top, they, they walk away from the game. The majority, I would say, walk away from the game but it doesn't mean they've lost the love of it. It might take a little bit of a kick to get back involved. And this is that opportunity, we feel, to retain that connection when they're ready. In terms of what we're looking to do, um, just as a timeline, you know, the first 12, 24 months will be very much getting to know and understanding who our former players are, where they're based, who, where they live and getting contact details. And then the dream is in five, you know, two, five, ten years time is have a database that's big enough so we can actually call out successful teams so teams can get together and we can do dinners and we can do events where we bring individual teams together to, to reminisce and, and reconnect so you know you might pull back the 1982 uh, men's team that won X, Y and Z and the 2004 women's team that won different tournaments and competitions 